Welcome to Devices Startup channel where we help you resolve issues related to different devices and gadgets. And today we will help you set up TP-Link RE105 range extender. There are three ways to set up this extender. First is via browser, second is via WPS and third is via the Tether app. So let's start with the browser setup first. So first and foremost, Plug your TP-Link extender near your router and wait for the power LED to turn stable. Now on your phone or computer, go to the Wi-Fi list and look for TP-Link underscore extender network name. You need to connect to this network. Once connected, open a browser on the very same device and in the URL or address bar type 192.168 dot dot zero dot two five four or pp link repeater dot net on the setup page follow the on-screen instructions then it will ask you to choose the network name that you want to extend so here it is simply asking you to select your routers ssid and you need to put its password for confirmation and just save the settings now you will be able to see the newly set up extender network name in your Wi-Fi list. By default, the extender network name will come up as your home network name underscore ext at the end. So this ext signifies the extended network and by default, the password will be same as your router's Wi-Fi password. The next method to set up RE105 TP-Link extender is via WPS. So in this method, you need to place the extender right next to the router and the both should be plugged in. You should have internet on the router. Then you need to press a WPS on the extender and within two minutes, you need to press a WPS on the router. So this is how you can set up extender via WPS method. Let's learn the third method to set up RE105 extender that is via TP-Link Tether app. So download and install the Tether app first. Now go to the Wi-Fi list and connect to TP-Link extender network. Now exit from the settings and open the Tether app next. Follow the on-screen instructions like it will ask you to select the network name that you want to extend and type its password for confirmation. So this is how you can set up your TP-Link extender. We hope you find this video useful. In case you need any further assistance, then you can get in touch with the TP-Link official support. The link is provided in the description. Do kindly hit like and subscribe button if you find this video useful. Also, if you want video on any specific topic, then do let us know in the comment section. Also, we do provide independent support for different devices. So if you need help with any device, then you can get in touch with our representative on our official website devicessetup.com. Thank you so much. I wish you have a wonderful day ahead. Thank you.